Flower and Glamorous with Beverly family and welcome. Today we are going to make some apple butter. We have um, Sweet Delicious and Macintosh apples. You can use any variety that you want, but if you use Granny Smith apples, make sure that you use a little more sugar because, you know, they're not as sweet. But these two together, uh, you need six pounds. So apples come in a three pound bag. So I have two three pound bags of apples. And this is going to be cooked in the Ninja Pot Pot. It takes about 10 hours for it to cook on slow to make this apple butter. Apple butter is like a fall um, jelly jam or whatever the people make in the fall. But I like apple butter. We eat it all year round. So I, I make it any time of the year. But it has your house smelling with those spices and it smells so good so, and it's easy to make you can eat apple butter on toast on your biscuits on cornbread especially fried cornbread uh, on your desserts you can use it to make desserts cakes and pies apple butter goes a long way and you can eat it just a tablespoon at a time by itself but apple butter is thick and what we'll be using, I'm going to peel and cut up these um, six pounds of apples. I have all, um, right here I have, we will use a fourth teaspoon of nutmeg. I have um, a half a teaspoon of cloves. A tablespoon of cinnamon. Four teaspoon of salt. And where is my vanilla? Oh, here it is. And a tablespoon of vanilla. You put the vanilla in near the end. I have the nutmeg, uh, cloves, cinnamon, and salt all mixed together here. Use one cup of granulated sugar and one cup of light brown sugar. And those are your ingredients. You cut up the apples, core them, well peel the apples, core them, and cut them up and put them in your crock pot. And they will cook for 10 hours on slow. On slow, low. But you come back and um, every so often and um, get your spoon and stir them up because it will really cook down. So some people like their apple butter chunky. Some people like it smooth. I like mine smooth. I don't want it with the chunky, I mean with the apple chunks in there. But it's whatever your preference is. Either way, it's still really good. Now I am going to um, peel these apples and cut them up. See, I'm gonna peel them and cut them up and put them in the crock pot. And I'll be back when I get all the mixture put in the crock pot and turn the crock pot on so you can see that result. Then tomorrow after the 10 hours is over, I will show you the apple butter and putting it in the jars. You can put these in um, small canning jars. It will stay in your refrigerator for two to three weeks. And you can also freeze it. And if you want to um, hot water them, like, you know, cook um, where you like your canning, you can also do that and it'll last a lot longer. So I'll be back after I get all of the apples ready to go into the I have uh, cut up all the apples, and they're in the pot, see? And now I'm putting in the spices, the light brown sugar, the white sugar, and 
I'll just stir these up good. They will cook down. We all will be all for miles. Put the lid on it. Turn it. This is a ninja crock pot. And it is, uh, it has a stove top, an oven, and a slow cooker. I love this cooker. So I'm gonna cook it on the slow cooker on low. It's not working. On low for 10 hours. I guess all the it'll go to is eight and I'll have to after the eight hours I'll have to um, start it back up for two more hours. But it's ready to go. For 10 hours, it will cook. And after the 10 hours, I'll come in here. I'll stir every few hours. Come in and stir it. And after the um, 10 hours is up, I'll put a tablespoon of vanilla in it. And I'll leave the lid off. And then I'll let it cook again for a couple more hours. But when it's all done, I'll be back so you can see the end result. Thank you. Well, Flower and Glamorous uh, family, I am back. The apple butter has been cooking for about 13 hours on low. I cooked it 10 hours, then I got up and I stirred it and added the um, vanilla to it. And I used my hand mixer and got all the lumps out. And so I am getting ready. I have these little jars that I'm going to put it in. I've already cleaned them. Now some people, they do a wash and they put them on the stove so the lids can seal. But I'm just gonna give these out as gifts right now. So, see here's the apple butter. It is so good. You can put this on pancakes. Um, rolls, biscuits, fried cornbread, uh, put it on top of ice cream, um, your pound cake. You can make cakes with it, like a spice cake. You can use it with so many different ways. And here is a jar of the homemade crock pot apple butter. Would you look at it? And I have several jars here, and I'm going to go and fill the jars, and I'll be right back and let you know how many jars I got. I'll be right back. I have finished with the apple butter. butter. <laughs> I have nine of them. I will be giving them to family and friends because this is delicious. Very easy to make now. Very, very easy to make. You just... Um, I use, what, six pounds of apples and the spices and the sugar, in which I told you in the beginning of the video. Cooked it in the crock pot for 10 hours and I stirred during the night. Then when I got up this morning, I took the hand mixer and mixed it up. Then I let and put in the vanilla and then I let it cook for another two to three hours. And this is the end results. Homemade apple butter. And you can also freeze it. If you want to put it in a uh, freezer bag or a container, you can put this in the freezer and keep it even longer. In the refrigerator, it'll last up to th two or three weeks. So go ahead and enjoy. Enjoy this beautiful homemade apple butter. 
And don't forget to subscribe to give me a thumbs up, ring that notification bell, and leave a comment down below if you would like to see more videos like this. Bye-bye. Getting ready for my miracle. Getting ready for greatness. Getting ready for my heart's desire. I'm growing into a flower and glamorous. Getting ready for my miracle. Getting ready for greatness. Getting ready for my heart's desire. I'm growing into a flower and glamorous. Getting ready for my miracle. Getting ready for greatness. Getting ready for my heart's desire. I'm growing into a flower and glamorous.